A Medford group is hoping to get more homeless people off the streets and into safe housing, but with a narrow plot of land, so-called tiny homes may have to turn into tiny duplexes. NBC 5's Elizabeth Ruiz joins us live at the potential site for the Hope Village. Elizabeth. If all goes as planned, Rogue Retreat will use this patch of land behind me to build the tiny village on the corner of Columbus Avenue and McAndrews Road. The more people we can help get off the streets, the better. Rogue Retreat Administrative Director Heather Everett says plans to build a tiny village would be a way to provide some homeless with a roof over their heads. To get some of these people who are extremely vulnerable off the streets into stable housing. Her goal? To help prepare the homeless in the proposed village so they can eventually move into affordable housing. But for now, Rogue Retreat wants to accommodate as many people possible on the land. It's just a little quarter acre, funky shaped triangle of land. That's why she favors duplexes instead of single homes. We're estimating it could increase um, anywhere from two to four more units by being able to duplex them together. Rogue Retreat met with a contractor Tuesday to fine tune the design. Rogue Retreat's planning committee will look at the duplex idea on Wednesday. And next month, Medford City Council will look at the proposed site plan. Live in Medford, Elizabeth Ruiz, NBC5 News.